Hey guys, welcome back to Sona 4 Golden. Now we might talk to Nanako, let's check. Okay, seems we can become closer now. This is her last one. I got a phone call from Dad. He's coming home. Let's make dinner together, big bro. There's a lot to do today. I bought a bunch of dishes, pickled radish, and veggies at Juness. Big bro, can you make a salad? Sure thing. <laughs> right then. You can be the salad maker. And I'll be the, um, the egg sunny side up maker. Wait, what are you drunk? Oh. Do you drink something? We have to start eating our vegetables from now on. A well-balanced diet is important. My teacher said that families help each other. After Mom died, Dad and me have both been lonely. But... But I have Dad. And I need to do my best so Dad doesn't feel lonely either. You're my family too. So, let's work hard together. Let's do it. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I'm giving this to you. Your family too, so you should have a family picture. Let's get a picture of you and me and Dad all together one day. <laughs> I love you, big bro. Hey, we got it. We're good. We maxed her up. Your dad will be home before we're done. I'm home. Dad, welcome home. Y yeah. I made dinner with Big Bro today. We made salad and um um a bunch of other stuff. I see. Good work, Nanako. Go wash your hands. Hurry, sit down. She's really cheerful. I'm sure it's thanks to you. Dad, big bro, hurry, hurry. I got it, I got it. Let's eat then. <laughs> Aw, that's so cute. Oh, rain, rain. Good morning. This rain. I don't like it. No one has turned up missing yet, but it still makes me uneasy. Yo! Sorry to butt in. Make room for me, too. <laughs> this one's already full, dumbass. <laughs> Why I forgot your umbrellas? Get not a, uh, not told to make room under hers. It's quite all right. By all means, Kanji Kun, you catch a cold at this rate if you don't. What? Well, me and her under the same umbrella? <laughs> the hell with that! If I did that, oh, it would mean we'd practically be, <laughs> we'd be like a couple. <laughs> and that's a problem because, dude, how old are you? Shut up! Come on, let's trade spots. You know how stupid that sounds. Well, that's fine with me. Not to mind if I walk with you. Hey! Hey, who are you calling stupid? Stop talking shit about me. 
Huh? Will you just make up your mind? Excuse me. I don't mind making room for whoever. Oh, <laughs> go and hurt yourself. Huh? <laughs> Why? Because it's obviously the best solution. You're too damn big. It'll be tight fit under Rio's umbrella. Not those, not those perfect for you. Huh? Perfect. <laughs> Dear, I don't need an umbrella in a damn drizzle like this. I'll show you all how it's done. Jeez, that it is going to make himself sick. Oh crap, we're going to be late if we keep this nice and zip. Let's hurry it up. Oh, Kanji, I gave you, I gave you a stick and you didn't chase it. Try to help a buddy out. Try to help my bro. Where everybody else did. Report it to the fox. Oh yeah, I forgot to report the damn fox. But I need to bring courage up, so let's go eat. Call the fox. Rain, rain, go away. Rain, rain, go away. Come make it on a school day. Might as well go to the movies with somebody. Goodness. Welcome back. Oh, I hope I get this right this time. Yeah, they're going to make real fish. <laughs> hey. Morning. Just around the corner. Let's do our best to prepare for it. 
Our class was late on signing what to do, and Miss Christopher Wall has been very busy, right? So, we need to pick up slack and make sure we do a good job. Oh, I'm not interested in the blind date part, understand? I'm not okay. Can't level that up anymore. So Well, at least Conjury's ready to blow up. Here I come, Conjury! Man, I gave you everything! I gave you that! <laughs> you didn't even take the bait! I'm upset with you right now. The other day I went to visit Dad's grave. It's the first time I went on my own. I had a lot to tell him. How was it? I well, don't Felt like I could finally face him. A little late, though. <laughs> Dad told me something right before he died. If you're a man, you have to become strong. Felt like he was telling me I wasn't a real man. Pissed me off. So I changed my looks and pushed myself away from people. Fighting gangs, thinking I was protecting mom, trying to catch this killer. I thought all that was how I was becoming strong that I was really making up for all the trouble I caused. I was drunk off my power. But that wasn't it. That ain't what dad meant. I still don't really get what being strong means, but I'm gonna start by not lying to myself. No more being scared of everyone, hiding my hobbies, staying away from people. Anytime, any place, I'm gonna bust right through as my own self. That's the way to deal with that other me in the TV world. As long as there's someone like that snot-nosed kid to accept me, I ain't afraid of nothing. Sir, it's all thanks to you. Yeah, we're almost done with Kanye. We got one more to go. Oh yeah, I'm gonna put those dolls of mine up for sale at the shop. They were a big hit with that kid and his mom. They called me just to say thank you. <laughs> I got a kick out of that. Oh, I gotta go buy supplies. I need a jet. Bye bye, Kanji. Oh, welcome home, big bro. And I don't have to worry about her. I gotta see if my sister's ready to be picked up. Okay, seems like she's not ready yet. So let's do the job upstairs.
Yeah, give me that 6,000 yen. Yo! What's up? What kind of event did the class of that your old school do during cultural festivals? The school here in Annabelle has a bunch of different events for our culture and festivals. I guess this is one of the few school events that everybody actually looks forward to. I know, right? I hope it gets really interesting, especially for some events in particular. Talking about those two pageants, Yosuke, we all know what you're thinking. Kashiwagi's gonna be in it? So that's why she agreed to plan this event. Oh, T.A. <laughs> oh, oh, of course. Oh, not so. Oh, the fact chick. One, two. Wow. There's a lot of signups here. I'm surprised what? so many people took an interest. Kick. Give me the keys back for the call. Whoa, Risa Kujikawa? Seriously? Oh man, trust a celebrity to kill the fun of it all. <laughs> I bet she'll draw a huge crowd. Wow, Yukiko-san's finally entering. If this was any other year, she'd win for sure. Now she's up against Rosette. It's gonna be a culture festival to remember. Huh? Rosette's entering? She's gonna take part in something like this? Maybe I better think more seriously about saving a seat. Look, Chie's entering too. She's actually pretty close to my type. Actually, I hear she has a lot of secret admirers. Of course she does. Look how she is. Naoto's that boyish, girlish, whatever, right? You know, she's a... Uh... Pretty cute. Dude, you sound like a pervo when you laugh like that. Mm-hmm. And it has to be but, the girl with the glasses. to be honest, I think she's cute, too. <laughs> Yo, are you free for lunch? I don't know why, but Chie asked us to come to the roof. She looked pretty serious. I wonder if something's happened. Oh, and Kanji's coming, too. Oh yeah, what's going on? You better have a damn good explanation for this! Oh shit! For what? The beauty pageant! You wrote down our names without telling us, didn't you? N no, it wasn't me! Why do you automatically blame me? Because <laughs> this is the type of thing you usually do, Yosuke. <laughs> I mean, if you don't want to do it, you just say no, right? Uh, like it was just a joke. We wouldn't be so pissed if we could do that! With Kashiwagi planning this year's event, even those who got entered by other people can't back out! Now her voice. Seriously? Must have been something in the fine print I overlooked. So it was you! Oh, crap! Hey, do you want us to take part in the beauty pageant? Well, yeah. I mean, you guys know how popular Yukiko is here. And on top of that, we have an idol and a detective prince. What's the point of having a beauty pageant if all these incredible heroines aren't going to take part? So where do I fit in? <sighs> well, excuse me for not fitting in! She's actually pretty properly, Yosuke. Hey, you want them to be in it too, don't you, Kanji? Huh? I ain't interested in that stuff. Naoto-kun, Kanji-kun says that he really wants you to be in it. What? Well, I, I, I didn't say nothing. What about you? You want them to be in it, right? <laughs> it's a pageant, damn it. You might be a little jealous, not wanting me to show off to other guys, but I guess you're not that uptight. I'm not dating you. I'm with Yukiko for all, for Pete's sake. Hey, you guys 
guys are inching onto the bandwagon with Yosuke, aren't you? So long as there are people looking forward to seeing me, I might as well put on a show for them. Of course, there's no need to involve my agency in this. That's right! That's the way to go! Teddy's looking forward to it, too. Actually, I think he was more excited than anyone. It was him who was pushing me to sign you all up. <gasps> so Ted's behind this, too! <sighs> We're in an awkward position. If we can't refuse, I suppose there's no sense in arguing the point. But it seems ill-fitting for someone like me to get up on stage. I wonder if there's any way I could take it up with the school authorities. Um, I don't think it's a problem at all. I, I mean, just do it, you know? Seriously. Dude, looks like your blood's boiling even more than usual. <laughs> Silly Kanji. Just tell her you want to see her on the stage. So, is it a deal? The four of us will be in the beauty pageant? What are you saying? Um, I beg you, please be in it. If you do, my, uh, doubts will finally be cleared. Come on! Make me a man! The hell? Doubts? <laughs> what are you talking about? Look, just, just do it, damn it! I mean, you're an ace detective, aren't you? What does that have to do with a beauty pageant? <laughs> oh, goodness, can't you? <laughs> We're back. I'm so tired. Where'd you guys go? Over to Jeunesse. We had to go get some paint and cloth. Oh, for the decorations. Thank you. Did you have them write you an invoice? Yeah, I think they understood what it was for, so they wrote it without us having to ask. There's some things I want to go over about the day of the event. Is this about the group date cafe? Yes, since Yosuke's leading the executive committee. Wait, what? It was your proposal, right? Are you serious? Well, all you have to do is the reception. After people sign in, have a few guys and girls sit facing each other at a table, conduct a short session first where they ask each other questions. After about half an hour of that, it'll be confession time. Get them to select the number of the person they like. If the other person accepts, that makes them a couple. Hey, Yosuke, you listening? <sighs> yeah, I hear you. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, if we roll up this bit of cloth, won't it kind of be like a ball? Yeah, okay, I'll be the catcher. Why the catcher? Hey, Yosuke, want to be the batter? <sighs> uh, I don't give a damn anymore. I'm in. Watch me slam that ball right back into your face. Hey, <laughs> you guys better get serious about this. <laughs> oh, that wrong my hands in my pockets looking down. Welcome back. Hello. Woo! Thank you for the money, Uncle. Hey. Nice. They look good. Great. Ooh, we got two things at once.
to read a book and finish it. Oh yeah, we need to go to the bookstore. We're running out of books. Only got knowledge and understanding, which I already pulled already. A cross dressing pattern. <laughs> hey, it's Yosuke. We're expecting great things from you. Oh, the, don't tell the girls did this. Oh my god, yes! Payback! Yosuke's finally getting his. <laughs> They're doing the cross dressing pageant again this year? Man, they never learn, do they? Ooh, some people have signed up already. <laughs> Man, what idiots would want to be in this thing? Let's see. Yosuke Hanamura. <laughs> Me? <laughs> Wait. And Kanji Tatsumi? You're on here too. Oh, cool. <laughs> Cross dressing. Wow, there's a lot of contestants. Didn't we only get like two people last year? I heard this year, even if someone else signs you up, you can't back out. Well, that's not cool. Hey, but what if they did sign themselves up? Ew, what a disturbing thought. Seriously, that's really wrong. Um, excuse you, bitch, but I think it's awesome. Someone else signs you up? Yeah, they see how the girls felt when you did that. Well, except for Rize, because she's used to that type of thing. It's them. They must have done this. Yeah, it's payback, Yosuke. You better have a damn good explanation for this. For what? For what, <laughs> my ass? For, what? for signing us all up in the cross-dressing pageant. It was you, wasn't it? Oh, that thing! Risei-chan started saying, let's all have fun with this, so I didn't really have a choice. And Kashiwagi seems happy too now that there's more people involved in it. You little... This is cross-dressing! Cross-dressing! Well, you're the one who started it! It's because of you that we can't back out of the beauty pageant, so it serves you right! That's beside the point. Don't worry. We'll make you absolutely enchanting, okay? That's not what's important <laughs> here. It's about a man's pride, damn it! <laughs> I'll give it my all. Whoa. Are you serious? Yeah, yeah, this has nothing to do with pride or any of that. You know already, right? Once someone signs you up, you can't back out. If you got a problem with that, go talk to Ms. Kashiwagi. <laughs> There's no way she's gonna listen. What? Why are you giving up? I ain't doing this, period. <laughs> Kanji-kun, are you still okay as far as the mandatory attendance policy? I don't think it would be wise to disappoint a teacher too much. You are a scary gal. You know that, senpai? <laughs> you <laughs> I don't think it's not a bro. She's not so scary. Just leave it to us to dress you guys up. Risa Chan's with us too. There's no way you won't turn out pretty. Yeah, you're positive we'll be pretty? <laughs> I guarantee it. Hey, why are you suddenly fine with this? <laughs> well, if we gotta do this, might as well go all the way with it. There's nothing manly about being a woman. I seriously refuse. Kashiwagi's sure gonna get angry if you don't show up. Maybe you and Kanji-kun can be classmates next year. Why is this happening? Your fault, Yosuke. This is all your fault anyway. But I'm up for it. I gotta see what he had planned for. We all end up in the same boat without our consent. 
What kind of joke is this? Uh, the exact same joke you pulled on us? If we gotta do this, might as well go all the way with it. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh, I can't wait to see what everybody looks like. Oh, you're home. Hi, hi. Okay, next up, guys, gonna be the Crucial Festival, it looks like. Yeah, is it tomorrow? Yeah, it says Saturday and Sunday. So we have those up in the next episode. I'll see you guys next time. Look at that many we got from the Dome of Sonic and the Dome of the, from the top. I'm so happy.